Have you ever really thought about the incredible distances animals travel? Arctic terns fly from pole to pole, caribou cross vast landscapes, and salmon swim hundreds to thousands of miles in their journey from river to ocean and back again. Not all fish perform this daring feat. Some, like rainbow or golden trout, stay in freshwater their entire lives. The fish that do migrate from river to ocean and back, like steelhead, coho, and chinook salmon, are called anadromous. These fish start off in rivers or streams as eggs laid in well-sorted gravel beds, immersed in clean, cold, well-oxygenated water. Once the fish grow, their initial habitats no longer provide enough food, triggering them to swim downstream into one of the most productive ecosystems around, the estuary. Estuaries, where freshwater rivers meet marine waters, create an environment that is vital to young fish and many other juvenile animals. From there, these brave fish swim into the open ocean, facing predators like sea lions, sharks, and even orcas. The ones that survive return year after year to their ancestral rivers to spawn and start the cycle all over again. These fish have been honing their ability to survive this epic journey for the past six to 10 million years. But in just the last 100 years, humans have drastically reduced their populations and chances for survival. Now, groups like California Trout are working round the clock to understand these complex migratory patterns so that we can better protect these amazing animals. With scientific monitoring projects all over the state, we're closer than ever to seeing the bigger picture, which means every restoration effort can have a larger, more long-lasting impact. Migration matters. Find out more at caltrout.org.